Thank you. Uh, my name is Bita Ahlam Bizela from Indonesia. My, uni uh, my institution is uh, Universitas Gajah Mada in Yogyakarta, Indonesia. Okay. And my uh, study, child abuse cases comparing before and during the COVID-19 pandemic. COVID-19 pandemic brought a major change in people's life changes in work or study habits and activity that usually took place in the office and school become to be done at home. The demands of being able to adopt the uh, to adopt quickly, quickly uh, do not always live up to the expectation. Mental stress is ex in exper ex experienced by uh, the whole of community. And this condition can have a bad impact on vulnerable groups, include children. The purpose of this study is comparing the prevalence of cases of violence in children before and during pandemic examine in uh, Suraji Tirtonegoro Hospital, one of our, uh, our hospital, academic hospital. This study is uh, observational study. The study subject were clinical forensic patient of child abuse at emergency room, Suraji Tirtonegoro Hospital. Data collection is done in a retrospective cohort. The initial stage in the study was retrieval of forensic case data of child abuse uh, found in uh, ER in March until December 1917 uh, until 2020. Uh, data Pre-pandemic is uh, from 1970 to 1990, and the 2020 data is data in pandemic period. Inclusion criteria in this study are medical record of clinical forensic patients, and the exclusion, exclusion criteria is uh, incomplete medical record. Data uh, prof provide in descriptive related to demographic and cases of child abuse before and during pandemic. This research has been approved by Medical and Health Ethics Committee, Faculty of Medicine, Public Health and Nursing, Universitas Gajah Mada. Uh, this uh, figure showed uh, gender of the victims Child abuse in global is a global uh, problem, and violence against children occurs in almost every country in the world. Uh, it's said by Violence Against Children survey that one in four girls have experienced sexual violence, and this uh, result of the result uh, the research showed a relatively flat in case of violence both physically and sexually against children every year in pre-pandemic uh, period. And then uh, in pandemic period, researchers get the number of child abuse increase to 26 cases. The research is in line with data released by the Ministry of Women Empowerment and Child uh, Protection and also the Indonesian Child Protection Commission. Gender of children who are victims of violence against children in ER uh, Suraji Tirtonegoro Hospital is mostly experienced by girls. This study uh, also uh, in line with the study from the ministry uh, from 2017 to 2019. Gender differences in child abuse have different impact between boys and girls. Boys tend to get external disorders such as alcohol abuse, while girls are more impactful in internal disorder such as depression and anxiety. The study uh, already uh, published before by Meng and the RC in 1916. Sorry. According to the regulation of Ministry of Health in Indonesia, uh, there are obligations to provide information on violence against children. Uh, healthcare provide must 
healthcare provider must, must provide information if they find a case of violence against a child by notifying the child parents and should report the case to the police, at least by uh, bringing document contain the age, gender and of the victim, the name and address of the healthcare provider, time of examination, as well as the impact on the child's health. If a doctor or other health worker find a case of child abuse, uh, they must uh, provide first aid, provide initial counseling, uh, explain to the parents about the child condition, refer uh, to other uh, healthcare facility, higher uh, healthcare facility if needed, ensure the safety of the child and record the result of examination and medical record and provide medical report for litigation if it's needed. This increase the cases, uh, this increase in cases is following by uh, an increase of need for the access to health service. Health service are very important in handling cases of violence in children because in addition to overcoming the health problem caused, it can also be entrance to handling litigation. And the next uh, figure showed the age of the victims. In this study, children was, were most likely to receive violence between ages of uh, 15 until 17 year old. This research is in line with the data of Janice et al. in their research at 2015, that the age of most who experience violence against children in Manado, Manado is one uh, city in Indonesia also, but different, uh, different island uh, with Suraji Hospital. Uh, the, the most, uh, the age of 16 years. Another study in Saudi Arabia, uh, said uh, different, yeah. Uh, there, uh, most of children aged five years. The reason why children uh, aged 11 until uh, 18 years to more uh, prone to violence in, is because the age of the ch child has started to grow up and is easily influenced and uh, by environment so often to uh, do not listen to the words of the parent in some country, uh, the parent often punish the child and unwittingly uh, cause violence to the child. UNICEF report that about 17% um, of children from uh, 58 countries experience se severe corporal punishment in the face, face and ears, and uh, or repeated beating of the head. Psychological violence against children is an act in chat that results uh, in health, physical, uh, mental, spiritual, moral, and also social disorder. This form of emo emotional violence varies, such as limiting the movement of the children, uh, not giving full attention and affections, capitating children, loving them, and so on. But uh, in this study, uh, we still uh, focus on the physical and uh, sexual violence. Uh, we found that uh, type of violence against children obtained in this study is sexual violence with the second order of violence received in both sexual and the physical uh, violence and the last cases is physical violence. Um, other research by Janice, uh, not in line with this study, uh, were reported uh, violence is persecution, as much as uh, 66% of case, cases, and sexual violence, 34 case, uh, percent cases. Another study in Saudi Arabia by Al Munif uh, also mentioned that the most violence against children was physical violence as many 42% uh, and case 
followed by neglect 39%, sexual violence 14%, and psychological violence as, mass, uh, as much as 4%. Um, the reason why women are more at uh, risk of sexual violence and uh, men are more physically violent is the existence of patriar patriarchal culture in the Philippine country, include Indonesia. In addition, girls are more attractive and less open to things than boys. Uh, in addition, sexual violence in girls is more likely to cause stigma against the family to be so bad that it's really uh, reported uh, in uh, many uh, study before also said the same. Uh, conclusion, uh, in this uh, research, we can conclude that prevalence, prevalence of child abuse cases managed in Suraji hospital increased during pandemic and the female victims is the most both in pandemic and before pandemic and most victim in pandemic era is uh, 15 until 17 years old. Uh, thank you.